afternoon children then we are going to study another property you already learned about the properties of whole numbers isn't it two properties already you learned the closure property and next associative property and next one uh, distributivity of multiplication or addition distributivity of multiplication over addition then what is the use of this properties children make it calculation easier isn't it you have to uh, do the calculation at faster or very easier that is the uh, use of this or that is the purpose of these properties you look here uh, distributivity of multiplication over addition you get children the question 3 into 5 plus 3 into 2 that we can easily do that 3 into 5 that is 15 that is a small number 3, 5, 3, 2, that is small numbers. That so we can do it easily, isn't it? Yes, look here. 3, 5 is 15 plus 3, 2 is 6. That is uh, 15 plus 6, 21. Isn't it? That is a small number, so you can do it. Then look here how is doing within uh, in the form of distributivity by use of distributive. Look here, children. 3 into 5, 3 into 2. Then which one is common here, children? Here in this first bracket, that is 3. And in the second bracket also 3 is coming. So we can take out that 3. Okay. That 3 we can take it out. And into 3 with comma means 3 into. 3 into. Which number is here? 5. 5. And what is the sign here children? That is plus. That 5 you can put it here. And what is the number here? 2. Look here. 3 into 5 plus 2. 3, these 3 and these 3 are common. That number you can take it out. And 3 into 5 plus 2. You look here. 3 into 5 plus 2. What is 3 into 5 plus 2? 5 plus 2 is that is 7. Then what is the answer? 21. Same answer, isn't it? But uh, we take uh, some time for, uh, for these two ways. We did that is on two ways, isn't it? It takes some time. But if we are doing in the larger numbers, when we are taking larger numbers, then we can do it easily by use of distributivity of property. Look at children, 297 into 3 plus 297 into 7. Look here. 297 into 3 and 297 into 7. Here 297 into 3. That will take uh, some time. Isn't it? And 297 multiplied by 7. That also take time. But look here. Which one is the common number here? 200 in the two brackets that in the first bracket also that is 297 multiplied with the 3 and here 297 multiplied with uh, by 7 isn't it so we can take it that common number 297 okay then next e2 put a bracket and what is here multiply by 3 that 3 and here multiply by that is the same number is multiplied by 3 and here also same number is multiplied by 7. So, you, we can take it out that number, common number we can take it here, 297 into 3 plus 7. Look here, into 3 plus 7. So, 297 into, what is 3 plus 7? That is 10. What is the answer children? 297 into 10 means that you have to put it that zero, isn't it? 297 into 10 that zero. What is the answer children? 2970, isn't it? Yes, then another one. Yes. 81,265, 
Look at children, that is a big number. All of you listen here. 81,269 into 100 and or 81,269 multiplied 169 minus 81,265 into 69. If you get a question, you have to read well or you have to observe that question. What type of question is that? Listen here, here 81,265 in first bracket and 81,265 in second bracket also. So you have to multiply this 81,265 by 169 and you want to multiply that 81,265 with 69 also. You have to Multiply the 81, 200, 265 by 169 and you have to minus or you have to subtract the 81,265 multiply with the 69 that you have to subtract from this. On that time you have to make use of the property, distributive property. Look at children, which one is the common one here? That is 81,265. Isn't it? 81,265. 81,265. 81,265. That is a common number. And you can take it out into what is here? Multiply with 169, isn't it? 169. And you listen to what is the sign here. What you want to do? Minus. You have to subtract or you have to add it. Then here, minus, isn't it? You have to subtract this 81,265 multiply with 69. That you have to subtract from 81,269. So, 69 that you have to subtract it. So 100 and this 169 minus 69. 169 minus 69. What is the answer children? You can what is the next step children? 81,265 into 169 minus 69. What is 169 minus 69 children? 100, isn't it? 169 minus 69, that is 100. So, into 100. What is the answer? 81,265 into 100 means you have to put in these two zeros with this number. 81,265. And today these two zeros. What is the answer children? 81,26,500. Isn't it? Okay. Yes. We understand children how is doing. So which one is the common number that you have to uh, make it out. Take it out. And next you have to listen what the addition of subtraction you have to do. Okay. Then another method. One more method children. Listen. Plus 
168 into 15. That 15 you can split it 10 plus 5. That means 168 into 10 plus 168 into 5. That you have to multiply this. Uh, what are the numbers in the bracket? That you have to multiply with this number. Okay. 168 into 10 plus 168 into 5. That means 168 into 10 that is 1680. Isn't it? And what is 168 into 5? 5 eights are 44. 5 6 are 30 plus 4 34. Then 1 5 are 5 8 40. Then what is the answer children? 0. 8 plus 4 12. 2520. That is another method. Okay children. So you have to practice it well children. Okay. Bye children.